I think the thing I love about fragrance is that it takes us away from the often mundane reality of our everyday lives. A breath of it can transport us, it can turn us into movie stars and actors and actresses and just make us feel fantastic. The thing that everyone should remember about scent is it says more about you than anything else you do, wear, or say. You can never forget a scent. It's like that, you will always be reminded of it. My new creation, Enigma Oud, came about because I looked at two of our biggest selling perfumes globally, one called Amber Oud, which takes us to the world of the exotic and transports us far away from the middle of London to who knows where, and the other is our biggest selling uh, women's perfume called Enigma. And Enigma is looking at the idea of sensuality, feminine sensuality. So I thought, well, if you put sensuality and exoticism together, what would you end up with? So I write down, if you like, a very simple basic formula and then start to put oils on little blotters. The blotters get onto a small device like a little windmill and then you spin it and as you spin it, it starts to mix the oils together. The scent mixes in the air and it gives me an idea of if the scent is going to end up the way I want and then you can take blotters out, put new ones in and so that's the beginning of the process. And the reason for doing it that way Many of the raw materials I use are so costly. Uh, the jasmine I use cost me around £34,000 a kilo, which is double the price of gold. So I'm always very nervous of just mixing things in alcohol in case I don't like them because I can't take them back out again. I think the most important thing for everyone to always remember is to take the time to find the scent that you feel really expresses who you are. When you go choosing a scent, don't go with a friend. Never spray scent directly around this area. Scent has alcohol in, it will dry your skin. One of the most beautiful places to put scent is in the clavicle. So if you imagine going straight down from your earlobe into the dip of your collarbone, the beauty of putting scent here, as you move your head, you have the pleasure of smelling it, but also if somebody comes up to greet you, they will smell it. And on the wrists, because we move our hands and arms as we speak, and it is movement that always brings scent to life. Remember, the greatest compliment in the world you can have is when somebody says you smell fabulous. The greatest insult you can have is if somebody says you stink. <laughs>